I haven't quite got the trunk coordination to put it in, hold it and chew it. There's the black one. Baby. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously being stubborn, didn't want to come where she wanted it. I think you will sit there. Oh my god, so cute. Just boom. Just one. They often have two sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> well monitored it'll come off again in the next uh, sort of two three months Thank you. 
Okay. Uh, yeah, I did. They split up for a while, but they appear to have joined up again now this morning. So obviously they're walking in the open across the clearing, so the impalas are fairly aware that they're there. I see she's got a collar around her neck. They do have, uh, she and the young male have both got a collar on at the moment. Very upset impala. The young male stall at the back there having a look. Just don't make too many sudden movements at the back and they'll be fine. Yeah, he's still trying to hunt the impalas. Look. Because the impalas are watching these girls. So he's just had his kill stolen by the fourth lioness, or the, the second lioness, the fourth lion. Are we allowed to go close to the leopard? Some of the younger members split off uh, earlier in the year, beginning of the year. They split off in separate sex groups. Males go one way, females go the other way to look for another separate sex group to start a new pack with. And when the pack numbers drop like that, uh, whether it's because they split or whether because something traumatic happens to the pack, then the beta pair get to breed as well to build the numbers of the pack back up. So, uh, also, just in case anything happens to either of the alpha pair, Mm. 
How long until this young male's out on his own? Uh, another year or so.